Hello, my name is Jupiter Hadley, and today we're doing another version of Jupiter Plays All the Games, this time with the Ludum Dare. Ludum Dare is a huge game jam competition that has two parts. What has just ended was the compo, which is a little different. Um, basically, you had to be solo and release source, and it's just a bit harder. It's less time. It's only 48 hours. There's also still the jam that's going on, and that's, um, you can have teams, a bit more relaxed, and you also get 72 hours. This time's theme was Connected Worlds. I'm not going to be playing all of the games because submissions has only been open for 20 minutes, and there's over 1,300 games. So, if you'd like me to play your game, then you can check the description. The first link after the list of all the games is going to be a link to a submission sheet that you can put your game into and then I'll play it. Um, but other than that, if you want to check out any of the games, there'll be links in the description. I'll be playing each game for a minute. If you want to stalk me on Twitter, Twitch TV, or play.me, links are also in the description. And thank you very much for watching. Next! Next, we're playing the game Down With Unification, the keyboard version. The unhappy plants in this region are under the control of the oppressive unificators by supplying the rebellion with crates of goods you can gather support to help free them from their rules. Giving a planet what it requires will give a large boost to its happiness, but of course they will accept any goods you get them. Happy planets will lend ships to your cause. Gather as much support as you can by destroying enemy ships and bringing the supplies to the surrounding plants. You have five minutes until the uh, unificator arrives to destroy any rebellion. Okay, so we got F and L. Wait. I got this. You want coffee? There's coffee right here. I like how space just kind of says space. How do I? Oh, R. Have coffee. Do I have to bring it over to the bubble? Okay. Here you go. Some coffee. Can I move these with this? Do they want cats too? I keep like wrongly clicking. Because for Unity, um, right mouse also does this whole like screen thing. Do you guys want cats? Yay, I have some cats. Alright, next. Next we're playing a game that doesn't quite fit on my screen called A New World? Question mark, exclamation point. Your people need you. Their home world is flooded. They must find a new home. Travel to portals to find a safe home for them. Hey, look it. It's our friend, Kenny. What is this? Oh, wait. Ladder. Shit. Okay. Did it. So our friend Kenny's graphics. Yay! Uh. How do I? Fuck! I didn't realize I had another jump. Yeah, let's retry. Fast forward, it'd be cool if we could like fast forward this going through. There we go. Next. Next, we're playing the game Ghost and Not Ghost. Press enter to start and arrow keys to move. Perfect. Z for sword. G for enter the body. That's a bit weird. Okay. Uh, oh. Let me get my sword. Holy shit. One of these grasses. Give me health. I need health. Health, 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 health. 
enter enemies to take them over. Okay. G. G. I don't know. Blah, blah, blah. G. I pressed G, nothing happened. Next. Next, I'm playing the game Bald Face Space Truckers, which kind of sounds like an insult. Arrow keys to move sh speed. Carries the space truckers about to begin. Try to earn as much money as possible without running out of fuel or crashing. Shift for high bar speed. Okay. Let's look at the ship. Oh, can I crash on this? Nope. Alright, docking, segment, repair, blah, blah, blah. So, fuel, strength, alright, so let's, uh, refuel. Yes. Okay. Uh, job board. Okay, dehydrated food. Okay, you'll be employed to delivery of cargo, blah, 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 blah. Let's try. Let's, let's do two. Okay, I will undock because that one was the closest one. Oh shit! Oh, shit, there's tons of stuff here. Just stay towards the top of the screen, and you're good. Kind of a long flight towards basically the same things. Anyway, next. Next, we're playing Space Watch. Welcome to the Solar System Space Watch. The Solar System is currently under attack, and your job is to ward planets of oncoming attacks. You must transmit signals between planets, however, you can only send signals between planets that speak neutral languages. The planet language are determined by the colors in its crest when you mouse over it. Use WSD or arrow keys to navigate the solar system. Click the planet to transmit between them, hit space when you're ready to begin. Okay. Okay, so the planet Mulk. What if none of these planets have the right thing? We don't speak the same language, though. Fortunately, the planet Mulk was completely obliterated. Well, of course I was fine. I don't know which ones have the same language. They all seem to be different. Do any of these speak the same language? None of them speak the same language. Ah. Oh. I really have no idea how to do this. Next! Next, we're playing the game Supernova. I actually have no idea what I'm doing. Can we take this? I don't really know what I'm doing. All of these connections. Didn't really. Hmm. The instructions literally say the goal is to build a supernova at my home planet, but it doesn't really tell me how, other than it takes a lot of shit to do so. We have to make planets build stuff so that we have enough. Next. Next, we're playing the game Pongo the Universe. I feel like there's so many space games in this jam. I feel like there's so many space games in general. People make more underwater games. In 1721, Isaac Newton theorized that an object with sufficient velocity would could escape Earth's gravity. In 1920, Hans Polgen and someone invented the modern polio stick. In 19... Uh, coincidence? I say not.
Oh, someone invented probably the trampoline. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I just beat the whole world. Oh. Yeah. Sorry about that, I don't like that fixer thing. And that's when the whole... And then there's the whole Icarus thing. Oof. Next. Next, we're playing another game that doesn't quite fit on my screen called Neon Nexus. Hit the uh, directions when bots are over it. Left mouse to shoot and stun arrows to move. <sighs> Space to stop blocks. Well, I'll check out that. Alright. I can't actually see that far down, so. I can scroll a bit. I feel like this game just isn't really made for fitting on my screen. What is this? Oh, I see. Alright, I get it. Okay, do the laser thing. Maybe I suck at this game. Every time you hit it wrong, they get less. I don't know. Next. Next, playing the game Protect Both Worlds. I help this town by building towers to protect it. Click on a tower to build. Be what, but beware, evil souls of victims try to enter your spirit realm. Don't let them click to shoot. So, we gotta. Oh, 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 oh. Build tower. Major. Shit, there's bad things happening, isn't there? I like the graphics. Can I actually shoot into that world? Nope. I have no idea how this even... Alright. Next, next we're playing Planet Wanderer, year 3030. Earth has run out of resources. It is the last attempt to save the human race. They begin to drill for resources on other planets. Little do they know they're not alone. What they unleashed unknowingly became their downfall. Humankind is no more. Earth is no more. Only you are left in order to restore some kind of humanity. Sector unknown. Oh, Insta died. Sector unknown. Okay. It was like a giant eye. Shit. Oh, shit. Oh, I must kill it. Oh, fuck. Next. 